I'm Megan for the Developer Show. This is your weekly update on the coolest developer news from Google. Starting on July 1st, 2021, we are reducing the service fee Google Play receives when a developer sells digital goods or services to 15% for the first 1 million US dollars of revenue every developer earns each year. With this change, 99% of developers globally that sell digital goods and services with Play will see a 50% reduction in fees. The Jetpack Tiles library is now in alpha. This library enables you to create custom tiles on Wear OS smartwatches. These custom tiles will become available to users later this spring when we roll out the corresponding Wear OS platform upgrade. Tiles can be designed for many use cases, like tracking the user's daily activity progress or sending a message to a favorite contact. Tiles can be tapped to open a related app on the watch or phone. We have updated our actions policy in the Smart Home Actions platform to enable you to more quickly develop your actions and to help streamline the certification and launch process. These updates will also help provide a consistent, cohesive experience for smart device users. More details on the updates and a timeline for rollout is on the post. MLKit is now generally available, making it easier to use machine learning in your Android and iOS apps. We're also officially adding selfie segmentation to the MLKit lineup and introducing a few enhancements to our popular post detection API. Check out the post for all the details. We're announcing the new cloud code integration with Secret Manager. Secret Manager is a Google Cloud service that provides a secure and convenient method for storing API keys, passwords, certificates, and other sensitive data. Integrating cloud code with Secret Manager makes it easy to create and manage your secrets right from within your preferred IDE, whether that be VS Code, IntelliJ, or Cloud Shell Editor. Check out the post for an interactive tutorial to get started. Please remember to like, subscribe, and share. I'm Megan for The Developer Show. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week.